Hello and welcome back to Dungeon Keeper, where we are looking again at this menu that we've seen so many times before. And, um, well, you know, it looks good. And another thing that's pretty good is that we now got a level 9 goodly hero witch on our sides to aid us in the next level. Because, um, yeah, that bonus level was quite nice, quite quick as well. Um, and, well, you know, it's not the one that I tried back in the days because I couldn't really complete that one. Uh, but yeah, you know, I quite liked it. And um, well, since the last, you know, the next levels won't have any transfer creatures, we'll do some more bonus levels so that we at least can get some aid in these last uh, few steps in the ever evil campaign of terror and tyranny. Oh man, <laughs> do I love saying that. Anyway, uh, speaking about the campaign, let's see how the world looks like now that we have this witch. And uh, yeah, just uh, let's check it out. Okay, so um, no speech. Blaze End, a place of joy and love. Nothing, the legends say, has ever spoiled the calm of Blaze End. So when something does, it'll be long overdue, and the inhabitants will thoroughly deserve it. Well, uh, Mentor, you were also long overdue with your speech here. Um, I don't know, but usually you're a lot quicker. Anyway, yeah, so the inhabitants of Blaze End have their punishment being long overdue. Well, we're gonna bring it to them, but oh man, <laughs> look at the state of this place. It's just a nightmare. It's a disaster. Imagine if you if you have to clean this all up and look at the sky. <laughs> it's evening red. Or hellish red. Wow, yeah. The world looks amazing right now. A true holiday place. So, I think that it's about time that we bring to Blaze Ends what they deserve and what is apparently overdue. At least according to the mentor. So, let's go. There she is, the level 9 witch. Now, I know this level and we need to do one thing. We need to, we need to secure our position, first of all, because we're going to have heroes harassing our ass and we need to prepare because we won't be ready to take them on uh, at first. So, there's that. Um, well, you know, if we take a look at the map right now, we have this startup gold and that's it. It's not much. There's this gold, yeah, which is guarded by heroes and whatnot, and there are these gems. And as you can hear, they're heavily guarded by creatures and things. So, yeah, it's going to be a pretty tough level, this one, because this is not a lot of gold. So, luckily, though, we start out with 10 imps. So, that's at least uh, something, right? Now, they should really start fortifying like crazy. Because, um, yeah, <laughs> our life depends on it. So, uh, right. Good. Well, um, I think that we got that set up now. What we want to do next, really, is at least get some basic dungeon set up. I know that voice, I know that, but we got some security issues to deal with first. Now, this realm, yeah. I mean, basically, we're walling ourselves off here, but the moment our gold reserves have run out, pretty much, we need to make a break for the enemy, and then we'll need to start claiming this gold. So it's going to be pretty tough. And um, well, you know, I think that we should get ourselves our first dungeon set up now. I think that the security is pretty much taken care of. So I'll drop you there, just so that I know we won't have any gaps in our defenses. I will make like a lair over here, and um, well, you know, we can have uh, I think like a hatchery over here. Doesn't need to be too big because we need to pay for all these rooms. So yeah, we need to keep it a bit economical and all that, but we'll at least get like some decent sized rooms. We'll make like this a training room. And then we'll have like another room over here for library. 
I mean, we got a witch, and I'm sure a witch is good at reading spells and all that, right? So, now then, to pay for all this, we need gold, so we better start getting it. And um, we're gonna build ourselves, like, a treasury over here. Close to the gold, close to where it matters. Need to build a and I creatures. think we should also start claiming the portal pretty soon. So, yeah. Yeah, we need to get a move on with everything. Come on. Imp, drop there, claim it. Like that. Good. Oh, and then you don't go claim it. <laughs> what is this? Are you insubordinate? <laughs> oh. Good, you do that then. Nice. Alright, so once this treasury is being built, then we can start setting up the dungeon, really. Now, we won't be able to afford any expensive rooms like torture room, graveyard, and all that. So we're gonna have to do it with basic creatures, and most likely it will be like bile demons and magicians, pretty much. But we'll have to see. Um, for now, let's get the first few basic rooms out there. We also got this witch, which didn't have a lair or anything. So she might be a bit grumpy by now, but... Look, we're taking care of you. <laughs> Don't complain. Well, I didn't hear you, really. Look at you, though, man. You barely wear any clothes. <laughs> wow, we got a Dungeon Keeper porn star in our dungeon. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I should keep horny away from you. All right, now then. Yeah, we, we will have some gold coming in soon, so... Well, put the training room down here. I will leave it like this actually because, yeah, you know, we're limited on gold and all that. So I don't want to spend too much in just a training room. I mean, we'll probably get heroes soon after our ass and they'll probably carry some gold. But, you know, I don't think we should rely on their gold too much. These are the later levels, so they are, will be quite strong and tough. So... No, <laughs> I'll be happy if we even manage to kill them. The good thing is, though, that because we have walled ourselves in like this, we do have, you know, like, well, we can choose, really, where we're gonna let the enemies in. Which will be, of course, the training room. Best place ever. <laughs> and look, there will be a witch over here who will, you know, if things really go out of hand, will be able to shoot from behind. So, yeah... It's looking good so far, you know, the initial setup, but... Hey, come on! <laughs> you freaking need to claim! No. Damn it, how hard is it? <laughs> good, yeah, like that. Take the portal now. Yeah, look, there are already heroes on the map, and <laughs> we do not even have the, the portal. Oh man, that's not so good. <laughs> Maybe we've been a little bit slow with everything. Ah, well, <laughs> we do have, you know, we are safe. They cannot... Wow, do I see them spawning over here? Oh my god. Yeah, maybe this isn't the right strategy, because they might pile up everywhere now, <laughs> and the moment we are going to breach them, we're going to be overrun. No, yeah, maybe not. I'm confident in our ability to dispatch those goodly heroes of goodliness. Spell has been researched. You need a bigger Look, trail. and the first creature is a fact. A magician. Now, you know, I don't really want to keep these magicians, to be honest, because they're not that good. What I much rather have is a barracks. So come payday, we are going to drop the magician back in the portal, <laughs> because I don't want him to snatch away our gold. Wow, and another party. A new room has been oh my god. Yeah, you know what, we might as well just gather all the gold now, so that we at least have it. I mean, there's no point in waiting with that. Our imps are, you know, smoking cigarettes most likely, doing nothing, twisting their thumbs, really. So, no, you go research here, <laughs> on top of the bookshelves. Yeah, look at that, see? And we didn't have this line of security, we would have been nowhere. We would have been <laughs> screwed Spell over, really. I mean, one level 9 witch and two magicians is not strong enough to keep the heroes at bay. Um, well, it seems that... Oh, uh, no. I thought that they were stuck, but it seems that they're just moving around, really. That's alright with me, though. I'll let them tunnel about for a bit. We need... Well, we only seem to be getting magicians, really, and um, to be honest, 
Why not? We'll keep one for training purpose, but the rest, <laughs> go back. I mean, this magician is researching like crazy and <laughs> doing amazing at it, really, so. Yeah. Witch, you are good. Oh, and you look sexy. Oh. <laughs> no. Wow, and the fourth party is already out there. Look at that. Yeah, can I have other creatures, please? Uh, game. Is that or is that asking too much? Too much. Why are we not getting bile demons? I wonder though. It seems that we're only getting magicians at the moment. Man, it's all right, but yeah, see, it's payday. <laughs> Look at this magician. <laughs> you go back to where you came from. And all of, they take like a hundred already for payday. Wow, they're so expensive. It is payday. Yeah, alright, so it has pay been payday now. Of course we're gonna wait with that as long as possible. Oh, actually, that's not so good. Right. You take your pay. Good, and go training now. I need you to be at least high level, but I also need other creatures. I mean, dragons? Uh, <laughs> I'd rather not have dragons. But maybe like... Um, Bileys, farties, you know, walking tanks. <laughs> I'd like them. Or porks, for that matter. I wouldn't mind a few porks. Porks are good. So, yeah, I don't know. Where are you? Oh, you're getting your pay now. You need a bigger treasure. Actually, come to think of it, we, um, sh maybe I should have paid them, like, by hand before payday. I mean, we've seen that that works quite well. Oh, and look, the heroes are just walking around now, doing nothing. Well, they can't get to us, so we have a sweet time here. That's good. Now then, um, game? Yeah, look, these are the ones I want. <laughs> look at that, I helped you a bit. Go and train now. Yeah, we really need you a lot to be a bit higher level. These are good though, because they got a lot of health, and uh, looking by the amount of hero parties that we got on the map, we kind of need the, uh, you know, creatures with lots of health. It seems though, to me, that they're stuck over here. What's this? Do I hear a dragon? Yeah, that sounds like a dragon to me. Alright, that's good. You need a now that I think that... Oh yeah, well, no, they were researching spells. Not that we really need that, but fine. You know, What I really want is the barracks room, which should be the next thing coming up now, really. So. Look, and we got two bile demons. That's good. Yeah, we're gonna keep like a nice, a nice army composition of bilies, really. We're gonna keep our. Oh, wait, what? That's another party? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, it's really piling up there. So at the moment we do not have any gold left, um, we are gonna breach <laughs> the, the, you know, the dungeon walls <laughs> and uh, have them attack. Or at least once we're close to being bankrupt. <laughs> Which we're not, look! God, we plenty of gold over here. Countless of, well, slivers and gold stuff. Oh, is that? It is very nice. All right. Um, so, what we're gonna do? Look, Porks, come into the dungeon. <laughs> now you, I don't need you, because you're expensive. I know the Bileys, you know, Farty McFarty is expensive, but he is worth it because he has a lot of health. Now you, I only keep you for, well, <laughs> I don't know really why I keep you, but... I keep you. Now, give porks, please. Kind of need porks. Maybe we do need a little bit a bigger barracks. Though, I mean, building barracks means training less creatures. I don't know. Maybe, maybe I need like a three by three barracks. We'll just enlarge it by two tiles. See if that will lure in. One of those lovely porks. A new spell has been reset. Come on, porks. <laughs> the dungeon is so nice. There are no heroes about here. <laughs> Come to the dungeon, please. It seems though that all the parties pretty much are stuck. Quite like that, actually. I don't know what it is with their AI, but <laughs> it's, they seem to have broke a little bit. Ah, well, that's their problem, not mine. Um, we are going to toss these buggers back, though. Yeah, payday isn't all that high. And it seems also that maybe we need a bigger barracks even still, you know. I mean, we only get, like, crappy creatures. <laughs> Can I have more? <laughs> Game, please. 
Uh, well, as long as they're trading, I mean, the f it has its downsides, but also its upside. I don't really know what we're up against, but say that we're up against like level 2 or 3 or 4. If we got level 7 by least, they got AoE attack, they will murder the whole lot in no time. So, and right now, it's not expensive to train them up, really, so. Also, Magician, <laughs> don't want you. Look at that, level 3, level 3, both of them. Yeah, good, good. I approve. You need a bigger treasure room. Now then, um, yeah, the good thing is as well, is that because we got like the treasure room so far from like the training area, really, that once it is payday, I'll be able to pay them by hand pretty, you know, cheaply and quickly before they can reach the treasure room. <laughs> Devious tactics over here. Oh. You though, you're unwanted. I got witches to do what you can do, so I don't need you. Yeah, see, we're up against heroes only. It seems though that these four parties are pretty much the only parties that will face, at least at the moment, it seems. I don't think that we'll see any more. So, what I might do. It's just spy a bit on them, you know? See what they consist of. Level 2, level 4, thieves and archers only, really. Dwarves level 4. Wow, a lot of dwarves, actually. Okay, so that's quite a quite a big bunch, actually. Over here. Oh, look at that! Wow. Dragons and bailies, but also... Well... Barbarians and archers and all that. Level five stuff as well. So yeah, we we kind of we're kind of not ready to take on that lot really. Especially if we keep getting these crappy magicians. <laughs> I mean, all I've been getting really so far is magicians. Oh, and magicians. And if <laughs> if you forgot, we also got magicians. <laughs> kind of would love to get porks. Maybe we need to. And large our barracks. Yeah, that was it. See? Look, now we got porks. And we're gonna keep quite a few of them because they train fast and cheap. So I don't mind if we have like five or six of them or so. But, ooh, look at that. Level four magician. So that must mean that the Bailies will be level four pretty soon as well. Good, good. Uh, yeah, this party over here, I don't know really, but I think that they'll, they'll also be like level 4 doors, level 2 thieves and all that. So, when we have a bit stronger creature composition, <laughs> especially in numbers, then I think we should be ready to take on the enemy. I think that I'd stay, you know, I'd stick with my two uh, bailies. And um, go porks all the ra all the way, cause they're so much more cheaper. I mean, 38 or 15, and they train faster. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this this isn't even really a question if you ask me. Now then, payday is closely upon us. So once that's close, I'll pay the magician and the bailey. I mean, the park is really cheap in not only in training but also in payday. So. Did you hear that? Pork already leveled up. Wow, magician and oh my god, look at that! Look at look at the look at the payday just skyrocketing at the moment. Wow. All right, good, good. So far, so good. Now, now I think that if I start paying you now and you as well you I think well, come come payday you should not walk off and grab gold really. what <laughs> it even dropped <laughs> all right so apparently if you pay them by hand they don't need so much the next time <laughs> oh interesting to know A new spell yeah look at that see it is we're not we're not yeah look 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 uh, they continue training so that means that oh crap and I forgot the witch Luckily, she does not have teleport or any of those shenanigans. So, which look, you're gonna get 68 gold, <laughs> and that's it. <laughs> and you're satisfied. Well, you usually want 400, and now you're happy with only 60. <laughs> oh man, that's that, that's good. So we're gonna, you know, keep a few of these very tiny gold piles at hand. So that we can pay our creatures just tiny amounts and they'll be happy with it. 
Um, I, I I feel pretty clever for this whole method. <laughs> oh man, I didn't really know that, but since we're so limited in gold, you know, we need to make the most use out of it. Now level five magician, well, that's not bad at all, really. I mean, once he's like level six or seven, he'll be able to, you know, just keep firing spells at them. Not just fireball, but he'll be like machine gunning the enemies down. Now we'll have our bileys and porks, you know, from like uh, a distance. Or uh, to keep them at a distance, I mean. So, yeah. Now if only we could get a few more of these porks, really. You need a bigger I mean, in terms of like the speed at which we're gaining creatures, you know, the right ones. <laughs> it's not going so fast. Like, not at all fast. Yeah, so this might this might be a little bit tedious, and uh, I fully understand that. But I mean, you saw the numbers out here, right? So if only the portal would hurry up with the right creatures. I wish I could just scream down here to the porks, <laughs> come to the dungeon. I mean, I've seen portals that spawn creatures a lot faster. Oh look, <laughs> they heard it <laughs> down there. They heard my screams. <laughs> No, but, I mean, it seems like the enemy keepers, for example, they usually get all their creatures a lot faster, you know, because I always have trouble claiming the portal, because they just keep spawning. But not with us, of course, you know, we're always at a disadvantage. Alright, well, so far, so good. We are slowly but surely running through our gold supplies over here. Yeah, see, now, most of this room is cleared out already. So at some point we won't have a choice, and I fear what's gonna happen once we break open this, you know, into the tunnels that they've dug. I think that we might lose quite a few imps and creatures, and I also think that they will just all make a beeline straight to our dungeon. So, that's not good <laughs> when that happens. I will have to see them. Uh, I think we should be able to manage. Man, if we can get our bodies up to say level seven, I'm at level five now already. That's pretty, pretty high level already. Yeah, look, this is all stuff that we're not gonna research. We're not even gonna go for Miss Kinkies, really. I know that's you know not so good, but maybe Miss Kinkies we can do. Though, I mean, you know. We'll 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 go for Miss Kinky's once we got uh you know once we got the other gold reserve over here. For now, I think I'm gonna stick with porks and porks. <laughs> oh, and porks. <laughs> oh, well, Miss Kinky's, they're good. Yeah, all right, all right. I'm convinced. We are gonna make a very tiny, eeny, Weasley torture room. I don't know, but this should be enough to lure in Miss Kinky. I hope. Miss Kinky, <laughs> we got a nice one space torture room for- Yep, there she is. Alright, good. And they're, they, I mean, Miss Kinky's, they are a bit more expensive, but they're not crazy expensive, so. This is still, you know, I think that we can do Miss Kinky's. <laughs> do her. <laughs> oh, look at that, though. Soon we will, you know, we won't have any gold lying around here. We'll have to make a Breach for the goodly heroes. Oh man. I'm not really looking forward to that, to be honest. <laughs> Our army is a bit tiny and puny, if you ask me. So, yeah. Ooh, and we got a third Bailey. Don't want you, you're too expensive. Go and steal some gold somewhere else, not over here. Yeah, look at that there. Level 5. You need a good now, of course, she is also there, but the thing is, though, and I just now realized that, is that she is a bit annoying in the fact that the only thing that she does, really, is just blow creatures away. You know, she has, like, this blow away spell, and that includes our own creatures, really. So, it's like, you know, it's a double-edged sword, really. She's good, because she's level 9, and she researches like mad. But she also blows away everything in the combat, you know? It's kind of like, meh. So, yeah, that's that. We'll have to see how it goes, though. If she really lacks in performance, you know, in battle, then we'll just keep her here as, like, the last defense. 
I mean, it is, of course, very nice to have that, you know, when they're attacking the dungeon. And she comes in and just blows everybody away from the heart. It's a good defense, at least, you know, I reckon. So. Well, we'll have to see. <laughs> we we aren't at that point yet, because right now we're hiding behind our walls, <laughs> like cowards <laughs> that we are. <laughs> oh, man, yeah. Not so good, not so good. Level 3 porch. Alright. Another unwanted you. Go back! Give me a pork! Tell them! Yeah, see, from level 5 onwards, the training doesn't go all that fast anymore. And once, the thing is though, that, I mean, level 5 and level 6 bile demons, yeah, they're pretty good already. But misses really become, they become good once they reach level 6, because that is when they uh, get the lightning spell. And then they're all of a sudden, they're like, instead of melee, they become ranged. And that's what we want. However, <laughs> I seem to be getting farties. Are our chickens so tasty looking or something? Because um, I asked for Miss Kinkies and Porks and I get everything except that. This, yeah, they're really stuck. They seem to not, not get stuck. But I think that maybe if we breach, then only this party will come to, um, to our dungeon. Because uh, the rest is stuck. I don't know. <laughs> that would be a bit cheesy, though. I'd much rather have one big fight where our bodies can shine by farting on our enemies, you know, and uh, sharing the pain. Oh, and it seems that yeah, pretty much all the gold is gone now. So no more cheap payment method. Well, oh man, yeah, look at that. Payday is soon upon us, so I will pay at least our Bileys and our Magician and our Witch by hand, and I'll keep <laughs> the other gold for like the next payday. But I mean, it's n no, it's not doable to do this for like all the other creatures that we got. All the other creatures, <laughs> which is 10 in total. <laughs> oh man, yeah. Right. I know, I know. Yeah, but it seems that our Bileys have moved up to level 6 now. And I uh, can toss you back. Yeah, all right. Time to pay them. You, you, and you. All right. So that's good. I think that this should shave off quite a lot of our payday, really. I know Miss Kinkies and Porks, they are not the cheapest, but yeah, look. All the expensive creatures stay in the training room. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Yeah, we have four Porks now. And yeah, we're getting somewhat, uh, you know, a somewhat decent army, but it's going remarkably slow, you know. This portal really is... Oh, crap. <laughs> Go back. <laughs> he didn't even left the portal room. <laughs> Already he's going back. No, but I've really seen faster portals than this one. This one is exceptionally slow, if anything. And it seems that the there's not any more heroes coming, so it seems like this is the maximum number really that we'll get. So that's good. All right. All right. Well, not much all else to do than wait. So you know what? I might do this nice trick that I have of time compression. And um, well, you know, we'll be. I'll, you'll be joining me once we got the. Well, you know, once we're at our end of our money, really, and once we got high-level creatures, which we don't have really have right now. So uh, see you in a bit. All right, and you're back. But um, yeah, not a whole lot has happened really in terms of level advancements. But we have gone below the 10k marker so we're gonna get our imps and breach over here oh but our hornies did one of our bailey didn't just level up to level seven so good anyway yeah we're gonna breach over there now and um well yeah payday is gonna be high but i'm gonna drop back this gold because i need to be able to keep full control into a new look and right now the shit's gonna hit the fan so just to be sure we're gonna pick up quite a few imps and i only want to have two claiming the area at the moment because um well you know i think that the heroes oh they wait they don't move 
and they move away from our heart. But anyway, like I was saying, yeah, see, this imp, once he will start claiming over there, I think that the heroes will move straight Your to our dungeon. Yeah. Ah, th oh, there they are already. Oh my god, level 8 magician? What on the freaking... <laughs> oh man, what are we up against? Ooh, we do have access to this gold, though. Alright, alright, yeah. So the shit's gonna hit the fan pretty much now. Yeah, alright, look at that. Now it's, now it's on. However, they should also have gold on them. Look, and it's good that we have trained our creatures because, um... What? Do I see this high level pork dying? Oh my god. I thought that our high level pork was really strong against all this. Alright, uh, maybe we should drop a few imps in there. Look! Go in to help! Nuke everybody! Yeah, it's our porks who are dying. By the bucket load, really. Look at that. See, they are all coming right now. Look! Help out! Nuke them! Kill them! <laughs> Alright, that's pretty that's that's pretty good though. I'm happy with how that went so far. Could have been going a lot worse if anything. Oh man, so much gold over here. Imps, don't go claim everything. Go and dig this. We need this. Yeah, look at that. Perfect. Alright, so far so good though. Could have been going a lot worse if you ask me. And it didn't. So we're gonna try and see. And we claim a lot more of this gold and see how much we can actually dig away and continue training our creatures, really. Because uh, that is the most important thing. Uh, keep our creatures trained. Wait, what? A spider? We got a spider! <laughs> Useless, worthless creature thing, really, ever. But, alright. Um, you know, we shouldn't look a given horse in the mouth. <laughs> so, however... Am I gonna keep the spider? It's a level one thing. It's not even good. Let's just dump it back, shall we? <laughs> I mean, I mean, a spider. Come on. I mean, you've got to agree with me that a spider is anything but good. However, the rest of the heroes seem to be stuck in place, pretty much. Quite like that. We also seem to be having all our imps. Oh, that's not so good, though. <laughs> Yeah, alright. Well, I'm not gonna hand pay all our creatures now, so... We'll just have to take the full blow on our budget, really. But yeah, I'm liking it pretty much. It seems that our only casualty, really, was a high-level pork from this whole encounter against the level 8... Well, goodly hero of goodliness, you know? <laughs> the hero Dumbledore, <laughs> pretty much. <laughs> yeah, it seems that that was the only casualty so far, so I'm quite liking that. That's good. Now, what is... Wow, you're... Wow. These tunnels, man, they extend, like, all over the place. Yeah, this is the way into the enemy fortress. Well, first, before we can even think of going there, we need to dispatch this lot. This circling lot. Your creatures are under attack. Yeah, <laughs> be just uh, right on time over there. However, they should start moving now. I th wait, whoa. Spells, traps. This whole place is loaded with goodies. Anyway, um, you might want to continue exploring here because I see this hero portal. Your creatures are under attack. Nope, <laughs> they're not. <laughs> yeah, they're still stuck again. So something has broken in their pathing, I think, or something. I don't know, really. I'm not an expert on this, but... Look, you, you're lazy. I don't need you. And the same is true for you. <laughs> I don't need you. I want porks and all that good stuff. Not crappy creatures like you. Low-level magicians. Pink magicians. Oh, man. I'm happy that we have claimed this gold and the goodly heroes just stay where they are for now, at least. Yeah. <laughs> and it seems that they've actually dug right through their wall. <laughs> so pointless. Oh, man. Alright, so... Right now, Imp is claiming stuff over here. 
I want to guide him a bit and tell him to start claiming stuff. Your creatures are under attack. All the right. Wow. Oh my god. <gasps> wow. Did I just... Oh my freaking... They're all level 5 and 6. <gasps> oh, that's not good. <laughs> that's totally not good. Like, really, really bad. Is... Oh my god, and look at this. Uh, they're all only level 3 and 4, but they got level 6 <gasps> and 7. <laughs> oh man, yeah, this is not gonna be nice, I can tell you. Here, have this magician to play around with. <laughs> Your creatures are falling in battle. Uh, yeah, I kind of noticed that. Alright, yeah, this is not gonna end well. So, um, by these, it's time for you to show your strength. And Porks, you need to join in the fray. You need to join in the fray, and you as well. So, this is pretty much our whole army. Let's see how this goes, right? Wow, <laughs> they're just getting blown to and from, really. But this is good, because now they got... They got gas all over them, so they're taking crap loads of damage, really, at the moment. We're winning a battle. We're winning the battle. Yeah, but we're also winning the battle game. That's good. But this was a costly battle. Really costly battle. We lost another high-level port. And we lost... All our Miss Kinkies. Oh my god. Yeah, you might want to train as well now, really. Wow. Oh my god. <laughs> that is not so good. We also lost a few imps, though. I'm a wow, look at... Wow, they were loaded. Look at that. Oh my god. They're loaded with gold. We're gonna loot them. Because, damn, they are loaded. But yeah, this was a tough battle, uh, if I'm honest. And I really think that it was the lack of creature quantity that showed over here. So, yeah, the thing is though, I am a bit picky with good reasons. And if we had all these magicians right now, you know, then we would have had a much worse battle outcome, I feel. However, <laughs> with that said, wow. <laughs> Oh man, that you saw what they threw at us. It's a good thing that the witch start blowing people around and they had the gas bombs from uh, the Biley McFarty on them. Because of that, you know, they took massive damage while they couldn't do anything to us really, so. Yeah, look at that, and now we got 23,000 gilds. I like that. Now, you might have noticed we got a third Bailey, and we're gonna keep him because I think that, you know, two Bileys is a little bit low. And they are quite useful, as uh, we've seen. Also, maybe you take up an unnecessary training spot. Yeah, I think so. I think you do. So, but good. So far, I'm pretty happy with the outcome of this first battle. And, well, there is, of course, still some more stuff to claim. And you know what? We'll make another imp and start claiming all this. Yeah, you should go and claim inside this castle now. Your creatures are under attack. Oh, but you only seem to be patrolling around that area though. Fine then. <laughs> we'll just claim around your hero portal. I don't I can't seem to lure them out or anything, so Oh, but I did saw something Oh, is that the spider? Or is that like another party of goodly heroes that just emerged? No, they seem to be on a fixed patrol route over here. Now, here's the thing. If we can manage to sneak away this secret steel hero, I would quite like that. One of your high-level barbarians, for example. And yeah, we're gonna use... You have bewitched a hero. What? And we... Oh, all of all the heroes that you can get, we get a dwarf. <laughs> I mean, I wouldn't mind getting like a samurai or a knight or something of my fancy, but what do we get? <laughs> we get a dwarf, <laughs> really. Yeah, thanks game, totally not need that one. Alright, so in terms of creature composition, it's looking alright. We get, we get porks and we get Miss Kinkies. Alright, move it now towards my dungeon please. 
So... <laughs> this is just loop baiting them, really. Seems to have worked, though. Look at that. It seems to have worked. Nice! Alright, good. So, now that they're gone... Look! <laughs> Go and claim everything! <laughs> <laughs> so, such cheesy tactics, but they work, that's what counts. Alright, time to drop the bomb on them. So, we'll put in our porkies. And our magician from a distance. And the magician should really do a lot of damage, really, to them. Alright, good. So, we mopped up another group of goodly heroes. Dump you lot back, and you. I mean, I quite see the use of one high-level magician, don't get me wrong. It's just that, for the rest, in general, I don't really value them all that much. Um, you know what, we're gonna keep this spider. I know I dumped the other one back, but we're gonna keep this one. For now, at least. And maybe we also need to enlarge our trading room. Because, yeah, you know, we need more higher level creatures and they don't even fit in our training room anymore. So, how much creatures do we have right now? 18. 18 is not a whole lot, really. We got 7 porks, 4 Miss Kinkies, and a stupid retarded dwarf. <laughs> Why do we get a dwarf? I mean, of all the things, really, we get a dwarf. Oh, and of course, they came with booty. Nice. I want that. Very good. Alright, dump it in the treasure room over here. Look at that, 27k of gold. Yeah, I approve. And it seems that the heroes over here are still stuck. And this is another steel hero. I don't know really, but um, I'm not going to use that till I've get, gotten rid of all these dwarves over here. Because I think, you know, the, it is quite literally a steel hero in the sense that... It would just steal a hero that's on the map, and, um, well, <laughs> knowing my luck, it will, of course, try and steal the lowest level hero, so, yeah. We're gonna wait till we've killed, uh, killed them all off, and we've got quite a bit of gold now to just wait, uh... You have tunneled into oh, a new area. this might not have been such a good idea. <laughs> anyway, like I was saying, we got enough gold now to keep training our creatures for a bit, you know, up till a really nice and high level. So, yeah, I'm pretty confident, you know, in us mopping up these dwarves. Also, we got rid of that level 7 barbarian party, <laughs> so if we can handle that, then we sure as hell can deal with this bunch of low-level gits. <laughs> dwarves and thieves, really. So, yeah. Alright, well, um, you know what, we're gonna... Wait, what are you doing? Oh, you're stuck. Alright, well, um, you are gonna explore by claiming land, and I want you to start claiming this area, actually. Go and make it mine. Make it so. Because, um, I don't know what's out here. There's all kinds of doors and stuff and things and all that. So, yeah, I'm, uh, you know, I'm interested in what's in the rest of the level. Now, I'm looking over here right now, and seven, nine porks, that's a lot, you know, so we're gonna dump one back. I can't even pick up uh, nine at once, so, yeah, that's more than enough. Alright, good. He's claiming this, uh, just as we want it to be. Oh, okay. Well, guess what we have over here? Look, porks, go and play with them. We also got a magician. We also got two bilies joining the fray. Yeah, look at that. I know we might lose a few low level porks, but they're also a bit expendable to me, if anything. So. Very good. We have won the battle. Where's that now? Oh, it's you, actually. Alright, well, guess what you're gonna run into. Look at that, and she is level 6, so she can dish out a lot of pain. Very good, very good. I approve of this. <laughs> a level, ses uh, level 6 Miss Kinky, that's pretty, pretty decent. I mean, she can snipe and blast lightning at uh, the foes, so I'm happy with that. Good. Dump this gold in the training room and done. But yeah, it seems that the more we claim and uncover, really, the more 
and heroes are gonna spawn. So these parties that were just... Wait, you are not going to claim anything? I thought I, I summoned you over here. No, dang it, <laughs> go and claim everything. No, but like I was saying, I think the more we claim and uncover, the more heroes are going to spawn. So, yeah, that's definitely a thing to keep in mind. And I also want you to claim over here. And Beware, what? The Lord of the, the, land, Lord of the land? Your reign shall end before oh. this day is done. Oh my god. Your creatures are under attack. The Lord of the land? Wow. <laughs> um, okay. That's uh, a surprise, really. Yeah, so... What do we have over here then? Because I think that this is the Lord of the Land, right? This creature stuff that we have over here. This goodly hero stuff. Or did he come somewhere else? I don't know. I, I do see though that his creatures are a bit... You know, his heroes are a bit distracted and all over the place. So we might as well just snipe off a few. Yeah, we're gonna snipe off a few. Look at that. Pretty good. We're gonna win this. Oh, yeah, I know we are. Look at that. Alright, so that's not the Lord of the Land. I know that, but... Ooh, look at that. Level 8 Bailey. Gonna have to dump you back. You, level 9 Magician. Pretty decent. Pretty decent. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. Porks, go back into the training room. The other lot of you. What? We got a level 10 pork. Alright. Anyway, so the Lord of the Land apparently is here now, but I can't see him or find him, so. Yeah, I'm not all that concerned about it. Well, actually, I kind of am concerned about it, but. <laughs> he's not. We can't really get to him or anything, so. Yeah. Now then, Magician, you I don't want. So, what, we, what I want you... I want this door over here to be opened. And Well, you know, since we got a pork, <laughs> why don't we have you better open this door? Perfect man for the job, if you ask me. There is nothing behind it, though, this door. Alright, well, in that case, look, you open up another door, please. Oh, there is some room here. I don't know. Wait, hold on. Another Baili. Oh, I don't need that. Seems though that the Lord of the Land is not coming after us, if anything. Wait, what? Your creatures oh, are this is a group of ha, creatures. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is a tentacle. And this is a new creature type. This late in the campaign, we still get new creature types. And, well, as far as I know, I quite like it, you know, they're my, well, not my favorite in terms of using them, you know, but I just like them, I just have a soft spot for them, so, yeah, pretty cool, pretty cool. Now then, uh, we're gonna be running out of that other gold deposit pretty soon, so we will build a treasury over here, and we will start mining this gold now, because we can, and thus we shall. I'll quickly tap everything on here. And who knows what we'll uncover for the rest, but... Yeah, I think that I'm gonna leave this sealed off till we're ready to, you know, just drop a nuke on those heroes, you know? Uh, level 10 Bailey, I'm thinking. Level 10 Pork, I'm thinking as well. So, yeah, we do need to kind of, like, take on this group, though. Now, what do we have to do that? I could, of course, just sacrifice a Bailey. No, alright, 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 fine. <laughs> oh, wait. Look. Oh. No, crap. Go in here, fight! <laughs> fight! <laughs> yeah, that, that, that's one way to do it. Look, how much damage will you be able to do? He's actually pretty tough. Creatures are falling in battle. Right. It is payday. Oh, okay. So, look at this. I drop a load of porks on your ass. And also, some high-level bileys. And a magician. Let's see how this goes now. Yeah, alright. Look at that. Look, look at that. Pretty solid victory for us, if you ask me. Your creatures are falling in battle. Wait, where's that now? 
Oh crap, they're murdering our imps. Oh hell no. Oh no 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 no. Who are you that... You are one lumbering giant. But I think that... Oh, you're, you're a level one Miss Kinky. So you're not going to be able to just take care of that. But we do have another sacrificial creature over here. Hey, sure, go ahead. Oh, you're level nine, huh? So I want you to train. I want you also to train. But our porks, I mean, they've taken a beating, really. So, yeah, we'll put that like that. You know, them in their own room. Your creatures are falling in battle. Your creatures are falling oh, man. Oh, what? We're losing all our imps now. Where's that happening? Your minions are winning a battle. Oh, man. The, oh, you cheeky bastards. They've tried claiming this, and now the whole... The whole load of them is coming down over here. All right. Well, look, <laughs> sacrificial bile demon. Yeah, we Your need the whole lot attack. over here. Oh no, they're not. Look, we got high-level Miss Kinky. We got magician. We got high-level porks. Look at this. We're gonna defuse this and like it's no thing really. Oh, I see. Wow, they are crazy strong, though. Look at that. Well, they, they, oh my god, I hope we, oh, wow. This is madness, really. This is absolute madness. All right, well, um, <laughs> time for you to move into the training room and see that you get slaughtered over here. Yeah, look at that. And I think right now, it is time for you to do some work here. Yeah, oh man. And yeah, that's not gonna end so well. Oh wow, these high level archers, they're actually freaking damn dangerous. However, that is from a distance and here they have to come around the corner and so we murder them easily. However, we lost a crap load of imps. So, it is time that we make a few more, right? Like that, yes. Now then, we also got a new creature, which is a dragon, which I totally do not want. So, <laughs> bye dragon. <laughs> Yeah, I totally don't need them. However, I buy these. I need you lot to train. I need you to train. And I think we also lost again. Wait, where? What are you doing? Your creatures are under attack. I don't know what you are doing, but your creatures are falling. Crap again. Oh yeah, I can't really drop them in here, you know, and this Miss Kinky. I don't think that that will end well. But they are on the move, so they should come to us pretty soon now. And this is only like a party of dwarves, if anything. So we should be able to just dispatch this group, right? Shouldn't we? Look, go play with this unwanted dragon. <laughs> That's how we do. And after that, I'll I'll just drop in like all our bailies and all that. Look at that. Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> 